Google doesn't know your Google password. If they did, a security breach in their database could expose millions of accounts. So how do companies store passwords? The answer is essential to file integrity, cybersecurity, and Bitcoin technology, hashing. Hashing is a process of scrambling data into a unique, fixed-length output that is unreadable to humans. When a user enters their password, the input is hashed and compared with stored hash, rather than comparing plain text. One popular algorithm is the Secure Hashing Algorithm 256, which compresses anything from a text message, to a book, to a movie, and to a mere 256-bit output. Hashing algorithms have three characteristics. First, hashing is a one-way process. Each step in the algorithm compounds on the output of the previous step, like an avalanche, meaning that it's computationally infeasible to reverse the process. It differs from encryption because there's no key to decode the hash. Second, it is deterministic and not random. Just like your thumb will always produce the same fingerprint, a distinct input will always produce the same hash. Because of the compounding nature of hashing algorithms, a small change makes a big difference. If an attacker removed even a single comma from a file, the resulting hash of that file would be completely different, allowing a user to quickly verify its integrity. Finally, no two inputs can generate the same output hash. SHA 256 can generate 2 to the 256 possible different hashes, so the chances of a duplicate is nearly impossible. SHA is so secure that it's used by Bitcoin protocol, in which miners must guess values to generate a target hash. Cybersecurity is a never-ending race fueled by the advancement of technology. As attackers grow stronger, so do we, and one of our many cryptographic defenses is hashing.